In a groundbreaking move, destined to recalibrate the future of automotive technology, Ford CEO Jim Farley unveiled the revolutionary Ford Edge Hydrogen at a virtual press conference that buzzed with the palpable excitement of industry experts, journalists, and eco-activists. Since assuming the helm of Ford Motor Company in October 2020, Farley has spearheaded the corporation's pivot towards electric and sustainable fuels. But this latest launch transcends mere incremental progress. Farley envisions the Edge Hydrogen as a trailblazer that will fundamentally redefine our understanding of what a sustainable vehicle is and could be. Leveraging advanced fuel cell technology, an ideal yet often elusive solution to long-standing barriers to sustainable transport, the Ford Edge Hydrogen is engineered to overcome the limitations that have stymied electric vehicles. While electric vehicles have undeniably come a long way, they still wrestle with issues like limited battery life, dependence on complex charging infrastructure, and ethical concerns regarding the mining of rare earth materials. Hydrogen fuel cells, by contrast, sidestep these challenges elegantly. The Edge Hydrogen pairs a state-of-the-art hydrogen fuel cell stack with an electric motor, offering a staggering range of 500 miles on a single hydrogen fill-up and an impressive refueling time of under five minutes. Equipped with a 120 kilowatt fuel cell stack, this pioneering SUV delivers a maximum output of 250 horsepower, with torque levels that give even high-performing internal combustion engines a run for their money. In his address, Farley didn't just touch on the engineering marvels. He drilled into the compelling environmental case for hydrogen. As the universe's most abundant element, hydrogen can be harvested from a plethora of sources, including natural gas, biomass, and even water via electrolysis. The emission profile of hydrogen fuel cells? Just water vapor, making it an incredibly appealing option for drastically reducing greenhouse gas emissions. Recognizing the symbiotic relationship between hydrogen vehicles and their acquired infrastructure, Ford is already laying the groundwork for an expansive network of hydrogen refueling stations. In partnership with key players in the energy sector and government agencies, Ford has ambitious plans to erect 1,000 refueling points across the US by 2025 with international collaborations already in development. Farley was also candid about the safety considerations inherent in handling hydrogen, an inherently volatile substance. He provided assurance that the Edge Hydrogen is the product of exhaustive safety testing and incorporates cutting edge safeguards. The vehicle's hydrogen storage systems are constructed from resilient composite materials engineered to absorb high impact forces, while an array of sensors and automatic fail safes are hardwired to preclude leaks or explosions. This announcement has set the industry abuzz, forcing competitors like Toyota and Honda, who have been cautiously experimenting with hydrogen, to take notice. The Edge Hydrogen doesn't just mark Ford's entrance into a burgeoning, yet still niche, market. It signals the potential sea change towards embracing hydrogen fuel cells as the long-term solution to sustainable mobility. Set to debut initially in California before expanding across North America within a year, the Ford Edge Hydrogen has already ignited a whirlwind of public discourse and excitement. Competitively priced to match high-end electric SUVs, the vehicle will soon open for pre-orders, with test driving events filling up the calendar. Social media platforms are rife with animated debates on the Edge Hydrogen's merits and limitations. While the prevailing sentiment leans toward optimism, skeptics question the viability of a robust hydrogen infrastructure. Farley's announcement regarding Ford's strategic partnerships for hydrogen refueling stations has, however, alleviated many of these concerns. The political landscape seems fertile for the Edge Hydrogen's arrival. Aligning seamlessly with governmental objectives to transition away from fossil fuels, the innovative SUV may benefit from policy support. Discussions around potential subsidies for hydrogen vehicle adoption are already in progress, mirroring the tax incentives that have boosted electric car sales. Given the priority accorded to climate change in public policy, it's likely that Ford's hydrogen gambit will garner substantial institutional backing. From a financial perspective, the sentiment is cautiously optimistic. Ford's stock experienced a modest uptick following the reveal, and investment banks have released comprehensive reports analyzing the fiscal implications of this hydrogen venture. While Edge Hydrogen may not guarantee immediate profits, the consensus among analysts is that Ford is positioning itself as a vanguard in an industry-wide, global paradigm shift. Markets such as Europe, Japan, and South Korea are already exhibiting growing interest in hydrogen technologies, offering Ford a lucrative opportunity to assert itself as a global powerhouse in hydrogen-fueled transportation. 
Interestingly, the Edge Hydrogen fits harmoniously into Ford's diversified portfolio of sustainable vehicles, which includes electric and hybrid stalwarts like the Mustang Mach-E and F-150 Lightning. This multi-pronged approach to sustainable mobility not only offers consumers a broader array of choices, but also insulates Ford from potential technological setbacks that could hamper electric vehicle growth. But the journey ahead isn't without its hurdles. Challenges in safety protocols, technical specifications, and a dependable supply chain for hydrogen fuel cells loom large. Plus, Ford will need to continually invest in research and development to stay abreast of rapid technological advancements in this space. Ford's pedigree of innovation and its strategic focus make it well poised to navigate these complexities. The Edge Hydrogen's ultimate success will also hinge significantly on public sentiment and cultural adaptation. As history attests, consumer perceptions can either propel or cripple emerging technologies. Farley acknowledged this during the vehicle's launch, highlighting Ford's commitment to educating the public about hydrogen fuel's benefits and safety aspects. Another underexplored facet that could spur Edge Hydrogen's success is its job creation potential. The build-out of a hydrogen ecosystem, from research to refueling stations, will necessitate a significant workforce. In an economy still reeling from the aftershocks of a global pandemic, the promise of employment generation could add yet another compelling dimension to the case for hydrogen technologies. During his announcement, Jim Farley subtly conveyed that the Ford Edge Hydrogen transcends the scope of mere vehicular innovation. It encapsulates Ford's holistic commitment to broader social imperatives, such as economic revitalization. Although Farley was circumspect about detailing every feature, he did share that the Edge Hydrogen is designed to be future-proof, primed for software updates that could potentially introduce autonomous driving capabilities. Given the burgeoning role of artificial intelligence and machine learning in the automotive sector, the Edge Hydrogen may well serve as a showcase for Ford's prowess in these cutting-edge fields. Moreover, the pivot to hydrogen reverberates beyond Ford's walls, affecting its extensive network of suppliers and collaborators. The specialized requirements for components like high-pressure hydrogen storage tanks, fuel cell stacks, and sophisticated sensor technologies demand a synergistic alliance with specialized vendors. Given Ford's existing strategic collaborations to develop hydrogen refueling stations, it's likely that some of these component partnerships are already under negotiation. Orchestrating such a multifaceted and synchronized endeavor will undoubtedly challenge Ford's leadership. But if executed skillfully, it could revolutionize the automotive landscape.